All right, we just had a uh, car with purple headlights, I believe, going 78. We're gonna go try to catch up with him if we can. I think he continues straight. I've never had a silent traffic stop before. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> Oh my god. Wow. Totally. Oh, going for two. Going. What are they doing? What's going on, everybody? Splicer, and welcome back to another DOJ video. We're going to be coming in here late, uh, late night patrol, actually. It's like after. It's like 2 a.m. right now. <laughs> but I worked till midnight, so I got home and I was like, eh, we'll do a late night Leo. Um. So but anyway, we're in here with the, I think this is a 06 or 07 Ford Excursion. So look at that light set up. Pretty nice here. This thing is like a boat, dude. I've never, <laughs> this thing is so big and massive. But um, we also, um, we're doing CID, but we also got uh, certified under Major Crimes Unit. So MCU. Um, so we handle any types of kidnappings, shootings, robberies, burglaries, that kind of thing. So... Um, kind of a step up for us, um, and we're just going to continue to keep progressing within CID, and hopefully the goal is to do some uh, auto theft task force here eventually, and bait car ops and all that kind of stuff, so definitely excited for that. But um, we're out here tonight, and uh, it's pretty tame at the moment. Um, but anyway, we'll get out here, and we shall see what we get into. The storm looks like some rain just uh, let up here. And, um, should be a pretty nice, uh, night here. Be rough, 68. Oh my god, what is that? Look Sir, uh, my name is Deputy Brown Blank Kennedy Sheriff's Office. Um, <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my goodness, dude, that thing belongs, like, down at the docks, not in the fucking county, what? Critical care four, what was the, uh, Oh, I swear I can't make things you up. You can't unsee what buddy. you see, unfortunately. Uh, <laughs> Oh, see how that goes. All right, we just had a uh, car with purple headlights, I believe, going 78. We're gonna go try to catch up to him if we can. I think he continues straight. Out of the way, tractor. Yep. I mean, this car right here. All right, we're gonna get you. He knows we're gonna get him, and he's gonna pass another car in the process. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> oh boy. X-ray right now, six county. Stand by one. Control calling for. Oh, you know what? We need to get our spotlights oh, out, man. Let's get our spotlights out really quick. Uh, X-ray Nano 6 is going to be a 1011 two-door purple muscle car 282. Uh, no additionals at this time. 3 Charles 414, 1011 traffic when ready. It's going to be 282 uh, Joshua. Clear. <coughs> oh my god. 10-4. We're going to be eastbound Chola Springs near Crossroads. Alright, let's go ahead and get out and see what this guy's. What? Oh, why did that not stay on? Really? Oh my god, fucking siren. Shot fired, shot fired. Alright, we got shots fired. I might have to go to that too if they need me. Hey, how's it going? Waves. Taps. Eddie Sosa. Oh boy. Hey, how we doing tonight? Oh, 
I don't like this. He's got a fucking mask on. Are you, can you speak, man? You take the mask off or whatever you got on there. Shakes his head no. Okay. <laughs> okay, well. Uh, Investigator Beal, Blaine County Sheriff's Office, CID Division, uh, Criminal Investigations, I guess. Uh, reason for the stop is you're going 78 on Joshua over here. Um, so, I don't know if you're in a hurry or what, or why you're choosing not to speak or something. Um, you get your ID, paperwork, be, uh, ID or anything, registration, insurance, all that good stuff. We're going to be cold for here right now. Uh, <laughs> this this uh, dude. Drove off in a blue no, a, I don't know if he's like uh, a mute or what. I mean, uh, pats all over his body. Okay. Here's Negative. We're in a vehicle. Oh, vehicle. Alrighty, appreciate it. Just to clarify, all the information on here is uh, up to date, factual to your knowledge. I've never had a silent traffic stop before. This is kind of creepy. <laughs> Nods. All right. Thank you for that nod, man. Uh, I guess sit tight and uh, be right back with you. This is very strange. I'm watching him, dude. Very strange. Thank you in ASL. Maybe he's got a condition and he can't, like, speak. I'm not sure. Maybe, yeah, maybe he's, uh... Union 5, 1, we're gonna be near as Pulse Gulf 305. Can we get additionals for a code 5 on about 68? Driver stepping out. Shots fired, shots fired. Damn, they got shootout right now. All right, let's run this dude's name. Negative, he's taken off. Oh, he's pretty clean and clear. We might have to go to the shots fired, honestly. Oh, he never even created a traffic stop for me. <laughs> uh. Honestly, I'm just gonna give this dude a warning. It's it's gonna take too long trying to explain everything, and we might have to go to this officer down thing. So, just gonna give him a, uh, a warning. He can hear. Maybe he just can't speak. All right. All right, Eddie. Here's everything back for you. I appreciate that. Um, just to, just to confirm, since I know you can hear, uh, do you have any kind of medical, medical condition, or? I saw you kind of use some sign language there, I don't want to, you know, all due respect, I just want to, under, you know, speak to you properly, and, is that, do you have some kind of medical impairment? You just nod if, uh. This is kind of weird. Maybe he's just choosing not to talk on purpose. Uh, ASL uh, voice lost eight years back. Okay, gotcha. Jesus Christ. All right. Um, I kind of understood a little bit of that. It's I practiced a little sign language a couple years ago, but. I think I think I understand a little bit of it, um, but anyway, Control. yeah, I know that car, right? Um, everything's back. Right, I'll give it back to you. We got some other things going on right now, some serious things. So just this is gonna be a verbal warning. Well, I guess written warning. So um, just need a, a signature here. It's just a warning. Like I said, no ticket, nothing, no obligation. Just saying that you understand that I talked to you today and. Alrighty, I appreciate that, Eddie. 
Alright, man. You're gonna be free to go. I like the costume. Love the car. Just keep it slowed down a little bit, alright? So, if you're all good, then you are free to go, my man. Take it easy. Now, I'm not gonna mess with them too much. Plus, we got bigger fish to fry right now, so... <laughs> from Foxer H1. I'm going to go in service engine 2, ambulance 2 out of station 2. So this other unit just pulled over the guy that we just pulled over. I'm going to just let him know, hey, he's got a speech impairment, just so you know. I'm not going to like stay on his traffic stop, but just to let him know so he's not confused. Oh my, what was that? Oh. Hey, and just so you know, uh, the reason for your stop is because I clocked you at 60. <laughs> he forgot to tell him why he stopped him. In and out of your lane. Oh. Uh, okay. you, you understand that? Okay, what, uh, do you, have, do you need a pen and a piece of paper or something to tell me what you're confused about? Hey, deputy. Hey, what's up? Yeah, I'm not coming in here on your stop or nothing, but just, you know, I had him pulled over and he's got a speech impairment, so, just so you're aware. Okay, I appreciate it. Yep. Yeah, if you want to, if you want to hang out, you're more than welcome to, unless you got other stuff to do. Uh, I mean, yeah, I can hang out in the back over here for a minute if you need me, but. That's fine. Just wanted to let him know. I was like, I'm not coming to take up, you know, take over your stop. I was just coming to let you know, hey. You know. I'll hang out over here for a minute. But just so he's, you know, knows how to address him um, properly. But, oh, here comes the rain. Here comes the rain. I'm going to sit in my car. <laughs> I'm not gonna get all fucking soaked out here. X for Nano Six, was that a call for investigator? Clear. If I could have to route to a uh, 099 Great Seat Avenue as an X ray unit, we have uh, two subjects here possibly involved in some sort of uh, section racket or extortion ring. Copy, just confirm you said that was 099. Yeah, thanks for 099 Great Seat Avenue Westbound. Copy, I'll be in route. All right, so we're actually breaking off here. He said we don't really need to stay, so I think he's good. I just wanted to let him know, hey, you know, um, you know, just so you know how to approach him. I found that out. So uh, we're going to 099. There's a unit that needs a X-ray unit. I think something about extortion or something, extorting money or something. I'm not really quite too sure what the deal is, but we'll head down here and we'll see what uh, the deal is when we get there. I'm okay with the rain as long as it's not like thundering and lightning and because then it's really hard to hear the game and I have to turn it down and that trailer is possessed. But uh, we'll see what we got once we get over here. Alright, so we're going to be rolling up here at 099. Not really quite... Okay, that's an interesting place for a stop. For uh, South 13 section. My big ass SUV is barely gonna fit over here, dude. I'm gonna have to. Cause he didn't take it out, what but. What is that? He likely had a confusion. So expedition? we'll charge him with that. Excursion. I just oh. actually issued a bug report with it because they took out the ghost skins on it, which is really annoying. Because they didn't have them for like six months, and then finally they added them in, and I was like, yes, and then now they're gone again, so. Hi there! Yellow. What up? Um, we uh, got these guys stopped 
They match the description of some folks that uh, we saw on camera beating up the clerk at the LTD in Grapeseed uh, and basically vandalizing the store. Um, so arresting them for aggravated battery and vandalism. One of them had a golden handgun on him. Uh, he's the one in the Sheriff's Cruiser. Hmm. Uh, the ugly car in the back. Um, <laughs> and uh, basically, um, he's got he's got felonies on his record with weapons related, so we're getting him for weapons violation as well. But um, basically, we found a uh, notepad in the vehicle, was it? It's not used, but on the inside it says uh, property of Madra Madrazo Cartel. Okay. So, what we're thinking is they're probably trying to run extortions on the local businesses. And I guess these two guys are just on a shit job because they have nothing written in it. That's my guess, but I mean, it could really be anything. But we figured when we saw the car come up, we call for an investigator. Because there's probably a case file open on them and wouldn't hurt to add this in. Right, yeah, where's that card at exactly? It's a notebook. Um, Trooper, you. You have it right now, or? I gave it to your colleague. Nah, it's right here. Oh, okay. Man, I'm getting tired of this rain. I don't know, right? I thought San Andreas was known to be all hot and wildfire and shit, but apparently not. And can't our department, like, at least issue us, like, a rain jacket or something? Like, I on. know, right? I don't expect you to pass this up. How do you think I feel when I have when I go back to the motor and it, starts, and it starts raining? Well, that's your fault for being on a motorcycle. Hey. Yeah, so if this has a Look, gang thing on it, it will most likely out, press start, it on a gang's advice or something. It down. Um, it's kind of interesting, though. But the extortion. Watch the news before you go out on patrol. No one. I'm gonna fill out the arrest report on the uh, guy in the uh, HP car, and we'll submit that because he's got a character got to go soon. So I'll get that submitted. And, uh, if he has to go before we get him booked, then he can just skedaddle. Okay. Did we get a name on him? Brand new. Inside cover seats the property of Madrazo Cartel. Okay. No, I didn't, I don't think. Okay. Is he the passenger? Let's see, maybe I found his ID on the search. Well, let me, let me, let me think. Let me, oh, oh yeah, I did. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it, I, it was with that baggie with a picture of the middle finger on it. That's what it was. Oh, my God. That, that, that'll speed things up. All right, up. we're going to take this notebook. Okay, I'll go fill out his arrest report. And we're going to put uh, it in a bag. We'll get that processed so that if he has to skedaddle. And, skedaddle, um... Whatever. Oh, oh okay. that's cool. It opens a little hatch there. That's cool. Um... Places... Notebook. Yeah, this could be interesting. Something tied to gangs and vice, maybe. Uh, places notebook. Into bag... And labels. Okay. What kind of mask is that? Okay. Uh, yeah, I appreciate you guys calling me out here. I'll I secure the notebook and I'll probably turn it over to Gangs and Vice probably. Uh, I'll be their thing um yeah very interesting appreciate you guys calling me out there that way we can look into it further <clears throat> okay <laughs> do you want the firearm as well oh there was a firearm like gold placed oh yeah, yeah that's right had like a gold yeah where's that firearm. at you when guns are gold they're usually the gangs where was the firearm? I get it for you. Okay. All right. I uh. I, I almost forgot about the gun. Yeah, I need that. The, uh, <laughs> passenger here, so out of character. Yeah, if you something got a with, you can something do that within whenever. a gang he's a part oh, of. Oh, yeah. Oh, knife. Oh, I didn't realize the prison got so close. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Wow. It's right there. Yeah. Oh, awesome. Here's Great. The, Thanks. Gun and the <laughs> knife. They're both badged individually. Gun's been cleared. 
Alrighty. I'll call for a tow out here. Let's take the gun. So we got a gold-plated gun and a notebook that says he belongs to a cartel. Definitely so linked definitely something probably linked to a gang or something of some sort. Notebook is empty, but very interesting. Twenty-two. Places in. Ignore that. I guess we could, we could have said gun cabinet. What sort of is that on your Taurus? It is bleached brown. You see, bleached my uh, ride along was taking too long to get in. Um, and so I was hey, sitting at the station for like an hour. And I uh, decided I'd make, I'd uh, take out the ugliest car I could possibly could. Oh my god. <laughs> I, was, I was going to say, even the name <laughs> of that color. Bleached brown. It used off. to be champagne. They changed it. Champagne. Um... Yeah, even, yeah. E even the name of the color of that car just puts me off. Bleached brown. Yup. I know. <laughs> Alrighty, well, was it just those two items then? Uh, I think so, yeah. Alrighty, appreciate it, guys. Take it easy. Alright, you too. Maybe you one. Maybe you should investigate the sergeant for uh, crimes against humanity for putting such a horrible color hey, in this <laughs> car. Hey, I love my car. You leave it alone. Oh, is it a ghost yeah, skin? I'm, I'm not driving it. I couldn't even tell hey, it was a ghost it skin. Actually does. It matches your uniform. Look yeah, at that. trooper. You should get this car. <laughs> it's, ba it's bad enough that you've taken a Taurus out, but to <laughs> color it such a horrid color. <laughs> it matches your uniform. Yeah, hey, why on, uh, you gonna deal That's with pretty color horrific color, not gonna lie. <laughs> yeah, Actually, yeah. I think County Carl's coming. Are now. Yeah, County Carl's coming, oh my god. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I, I hear him, I hear him what? pulling up. Wow, there, County Carl, or, or, sorry, not County Carl, uh, Tow Truck uh, Terry. Uh, yeah, there he is. Hey, folks, it's Tow Truck Terry, oh, you need this car to the road. Oh, they will back up to him. What is that? Oh, well, right, that should be good. Let's check this thing out. I right, mind some of these papers for me. We're out of uh, here. And, uh, <laughs> there we go. I don't know what the hell that is, but we're out of there. <laughs> we secured the weapon and uh, the notebook, which is, like I said, pretty interesting. So we're going to take that over. And uh, we will log that in and go from there. Oh my god. Wow. You totally. Oh, going for two. Going. What are they doing? Drifting around those corners. We're uh, just trying to get it back up to Polito. Um, since we're heading there anyway, uh, we're going to take. We're going to take the evidence up to BCSO headquarters, is what Polito is. Um, but uh, if it was like an actual crime crime scene. Uh, we're actually, from now on, we're going to be taking, like, you know, evidence, evidence, like, your crime scene, a homicide, burglary, anything like that. We'll be actually taking it to the crime lab, so hopefully we will get to see that in the next, uh, next, uh, CAD episode. That'd be pretty cool. And also, we can use, like, a, uh, a special suit now. We can use, like, a, uh, how to explain it? It's like a, uh, what is the name of that, uh... Oh my god, what are they called? Like, those contaminant suits or whatever, you know? Uh, there's a word that I'm missing, and I can't fucking think of it. But, you know, that full suit with the mask and everything, and the gloves, and the... Like, yeah, that contamination mask, or suit. I don't... I can't think of the fucking name for it, but... Um... So, yeah, obviously that's only used for, like, biohazard stuff. Yeah, biohazard suit. So, yeah, we can actually wear that now. However, only, like, when we're you know, dealing with very dangerous chemicals and, and stuff. But I don't know. Maybe we'll see that sometime. But uh, we'll get up here to uh, Polito and we'll turn in that evidence. And we'll probably wrap it up there. Wasn't too busy of a patrol tonight. But uh, that's okay. Alright, we made it back to the station. Of course, it's fucking raining again. Because why the hell not? Let's go ahead... Grabs weapon out of case and a notebook. Close the trunk. Uh, almost chopped her head off. Alright, let's go ahead and 
Hurry up and take this in before it gets all wet. I mean, I guess they're in bags, but... All right, go ahead and put it in the storage room here. Logs in. Locks door via keypad. There we go. And uh, voila, we have it logged in. And all is good there. If you guys enjoyed this one, uh, like I said, not too much action you know too many things happened but uh hopefully we'll get some more in the future uh, loving the excursion being allowed to drive that now also we're gonna get in uh some more with the 2018 tahoe i don't think i've used that one yet i think i might have used it in the live stream but we can use 18 tahoe as well so stay tuned for that and uh with that said splicer out take care